everyone, welcome back to BrickCraft, and on today's video I'm going to be showing you how I made this awesome lightsaber pen. Um, I'm going to be using some Bic round stick. Um, these don't melt in the oven, and you want to make sure you take the ink out uh, before you do anything. I actually forgot to do that um, and show you guys that I took that out, but you do that. You're going to be using silver, black, and red clay. You'll also need some triple thick and a paintbrush and I'll be using my pasta machine for this. So it's time to start crafting. The first thing you're going to want to do is condition all your clay because when you if you put it through a pasta machine and it's not conditioned it just crumbles into little pieces. And I take mine through my pasta machine a few times. I start at a wider setting and move to thinner. Um, my big thick thicker setting is one and then it gets thinner as it goes to ten so I think I took mine down to about a five or six and then I'm gonna lay it out and I'm going to size it to the pen like I said before you do this make sure you take out the tip part where the ink is I actually forgot to do that until the last moment and it actually made it really hard to do then you're gonna take and wrap that red clay around your pen and cut off the excess clay and then just smooth out all those lines. Then I took my silver clay in on about the same setting and I'm going to just cut a small little part of that because it's going to go on the bottom part of my lightsaber pen. It's just going to be where the, like where you grip it, um, like if it was a real lightsaber. So you're going to want about maybe an inch, inch and a half thick. You're going to wrap that around, cut off the excess, and then smooth out the edges. I think I took my black clay around at a lower setting, so like 7 maybe, and I'm going to cut a strip of the black clay at maybe a quarter inch thick, and then I'm going to go ahead and place this on my pen. It's going to go near the top of where the handle would be on the lightsaber and I'm going to wrap that around and cut off the excess and smooth the edges. And then at the bottom of the pen, I'm going to wrap another piece of black around and smooth out the edges. And I'm going to make sure that this piece goes up over the end part as well because this is the bottom of the lightsaber. Next I'm going to take a really thin piece of the silver clay and wrap that around where the black overlaps at the bottom and this will create more dimension to the lightsaber handle. Now I'm going to begin working on some of the little details. There's not much to do but um, it makes it look cooler. I just cut a thin piece of this leftover silver and then make a bunch of little strips of the silver clay and then I'm going to go ahead and grab my pen and make little lines going around at the top part of the handle of the lightsaber.
Then next I'm going to roll some little black uh, balls of clay. And these are going to be like the little buttons on the lightsaber. Except uh, I take off the top black uh, button for adding a red button, which makes it look more realistic. Then I also make some little silver balls of clay and press those around the very bottom of the pen slash lightsaber. And once I'm all finished with that, I'm going to put this in the oven and bake it at 275 for 15 minutes. And when it comes out of the oven, I just add about two layers of triple thick for maximum protection so that nothing falls off of it. And I'm finished with my lightsaber pen. This is a perfect idea to do for back to school. Um, I know that a lot of you are going back to school. so. I'm going to be making some more of these awesome geeky pens because, I don't know, they're just awesome. Thanks for watching, guys, and if you want to see some more videos by me, go ahead and click the link on the wallet right there. It'll take you to my last video. Don't forget to check out the description. I have a store envy where I sell a lot of my crafts, as well as a Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.